The U.S. banking turmoil continues and will have a lasting effect. That's according to J.P. Morgan Chase CEO Jamie Dimon in his annual letter to shareholders released on Tuesday, who wrote, quote, The current crisis is not yet over, and even when it is behind us, there will be repercussions from it for years to come, end quote. The risks that led to the current crisis were hiding in plain sight, Diamond wrote, citing the interest rate exposure and the level of uninsured deposits at Silicon Valley Bank. But he downplayed similarities to the global financial crisis. While the 2008 crash hit large banks, mortgage lenders, and insurers with global interconnections, Diamond said, quote, This current banking crisis involves far fewer financial players and fewer issues that need to be resolved, end quote. He added that storm clouds are still threatening the economy and that the banking system is under renewed stress after the failure of Silicon Valley Bank and Credit Suisse's rescue by UBS last month. The Credit Suisse chairman apologized Tuesday for taking the bank to the brink of bankruptcy. As the current crisis unfolded, Diamond, the head of the country's largest lender, played a central role, helping to arrange a $30 billion lifeline for First Republic Bank from 11 financial institutions. He said any new regulations in response to the latest turmoil should be thoughtful, including clearer rules for dealing with failed banks.